Welcome back, ladies and gents. Oh, sorry. As I was saying, hail friend and welcome back. Um, we are standing outside the Eye of Newt store, and we don't really have much else to buy there. We bought a few good enchantable items, and we will just enchant them right now. Becomes a Kalai Amulet of Health. We can just sell that back off. It's for, it sells for 2,000 gold, so we should be able to at least break even by about 200 gold pieces on that. Um, enchant item, we'll enchant the Warlord Belt. And because it has a useful enchantment on it, we will actually equip it, because we don't have any belts equipped. Also notice how the graphic is kind of off with the belt. It happens, there's not much you can do about it. <clears throat> Excuse me. And we'll enchant the Almighty Crown, too. And it became a... Almighty Crown of Protection. Very, very useful, but it doesn't give us an armor class boost, so I'm just going to keep it in our inventory. It's only one square big, so I figure if we need if we need emergency resistance in a pinch, we'll just equip that. I mean, it's a good idea. It's like carrying around a resistance potion, only it's not one use. It's useful for everything. Um, let's see now. Full screen it. And skills. What do we do for our skills? Um, I just want to keep his, and I just want to keep his skill points to keep on going here, so that we can learn master water magic pretty soon here. Um, I'm going to get, equip her with a bit more spirit magic because it will help her, it'll help us hit harder and faster and such. Um, I'm not sure what I want to do with her. I want to give her air magic, but I want to give her bow, and I want to give her chain, and I want to give her everything really. Um, I'll give her another rank and size spear expert because it'll boost her armor class and her chance to hit. Um, with him, I will... Goodness, I don't know what I'll do. I should get a bodybuilding rank increase on him, because it gives him... It could give him an extra 16 hit points, but... Instead, I think I'm just going to go with... Yeah, with plate for right now. Not much, really, that we can spend our points on, because we're starting to get to the point where we need to level up multiple times in a row to get a skill increase. Um, let me see where the, where the royal lines take us. Need a ride? Four days of free haven. Let's, let me rub my chin real quick here as I decide what to do. We could go to the Hall of the Fire Lord, but I'm still not convinced that we should head there just yet. It's a very long, complex dungeon. Even though we have Town Portal, it's still rather dangerous to do without Fire Blast. So, hitch up the horses. We'll head out to free haven. And there's a couple dungeons in here which I think we should be able to handle. And there's plenty of other places that we can travel from here. All roads lead to Freehaven, so it's very, very useful for us to explore around here. Oh, and like I said, Fire Blast. We have enough gold to be able to buy it now, so... We've got Inferno, we've got Haste, Fire Blast. Here we go. And what I'm also going to do is I'm going to try to pick up Lloyd's Beacon if it's in. It would be a very useful spell for us to pick up. Uh, plenty of Ice Blasts, but no Lloyd's Beacon. Sorry, folks. Acid Burst would be very nice, too. It's a very, very powerful direct damage spell, so I'm going to buy that. It can deal upwards of 72 points of damage right now, which is very, very nice. Okay. Okay. But just to give you a bit of an example here, let me move to the edge of town so I don't fry any innocent standbys. Standby people. This is what Fire Blast does. Now imagine that up close. All five of them hitting and dealing about... Um, let's see, what's the skill inside of Fire Magic? Five. Imagine that dealing five to fifty, or imagine that dealing nine to nineteen damage for every single one that hits, and that's across five jets of fire. That is a powerful blow dealt right there. Uh, five times nineteen. That's um goodness. That's almost ninety points of damage hitting it right there. And the nice thing is, if somebody goes down after that, they can ooh. Uh. I see you there. <sighs> Trying to... Okay, I'm gonna cast protection from fire. I'm 
also going to cast Shield. There we go. And also Bless. Didn't know that all these were out here. Oops. Yeah, Fire Archers are pretty resistant to fire, so Meteor Shower won't exactly take care of a lot of them. And the way that she's jutted out there like that makes it extremely annoying because, well... There we go. Sometimes a good old fireball is what you for. Trying not to let her get too close. One point of damage. Nice roll that you did there. I'm trying to get them before they close in too close. I can't meter shower them anymore. Ah, bless. It might have reached that point already. I'm going to try to do is I'm going to try to angle her out of my field of view. That might be able to coerce the meteor shower to drop correctly. Haha. <laughs> it worked. Now if we can just kill these before they kill us. Ouch. Cast Ice Bolt. Uh, cast Acid Burst. I only hit her for two points of damage. Oh wow. That's pretty terrible. Um, cast Ice Bolt on her. Ice Bolt seems to work pretty well. Decently, anyways. You gotta watch out for them, too. They love to throw fireballs at you. Cast another fireball. And she just outright resisted it. It's crazy. But I'm close and close up to you. I've had it with your sass. Jeez. There we go. I knew I should have casted heroes. There we go. Got a longbow, 150 gold. This is gonna be a nice little stash of gold that we got right here. And this is another temple of Ba. It doesn't really do much, but it has some monsters outside out front, so I wanted to clear it out. The Order of Ba welcomes you, friend. Yeah. <laughs> Let's not go in there. Goodness, we've got, we've got Wizard Eye activated, so if we see any, if there's anything out of the place, we're going to be able to see it, I believe. I see more archers out this way. I'm not sure if I want to fight them right now. I don't see too many fire archers out there, just only a couple of them. Give me a second to heal up, and then we'll go out and we'll tackle them. Come on. There you go. Another thing that I'm going to save up for, too, after I'm done with all this, Power Cure. Power Cure would help us out so much right now. And, yeah, you'll have to forgive the fog. It's a little bit like that outside right now. I think they're starting to mobilize because they saw me. I want to hurry up and get close to them because they're nice and tightly packed in like that. And now we got them like this. I'm going to angle her out of my view and cast a little meteor shower. <laughs> it's a very, very nice high damage spell like that. None of spell points. We'll just wait until he gets his back. 
And since there's two fire archers, three fire archers out there, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get real close with heroism. And then just finish him off in close range. Oh, uh. 